weathered down, but still elegant in your eyes. I am darkened by the face of the earth, but you find me loveliest of all. Others see my rough edges, but you mark and accent my beauty. I love you, and not because you favored me, but because you were the answer to my prayers. When I hear your voice, I know there is gentleness in your ways. Fine muscles ripple beneath your skin, quiet and deep-rooted like your faithfulness. In your smile, there is kindness. Your mouth is elegant and inviting. Your mind strong and pure. Your eyes are like doves, soft and bright, but deep-set, brimming with meaning, like a well of water where only I can see into your soul. things that we know about Bivin, but for, for us personally, my wife and I, he has the purest of hearts, literally, and knowing Shelly for the past um, couple of years, she has also the purest of hearts, and them two meeting and getting married to each other, it's, it's the most beautiful thing, honestly, in, in my opinion, and seeing my brother so happy, it's, 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 it's amazing.
God is love. No matter your belief in God, it is such an awesome statement to contain God in one word. In fact, he himself is the one to say it. How great must that word be? It is patient, kind, gentle, keeps no record of wrongs, and you can go on and on. Love is giving, it is holding, it is more than feelings, it's a state of being. It is being vulnerable, putting your whole heart into someone else's hands and trusting they will take care of it. Love is knowing you come back from a day's journey with the full assurance you have a special someone who simply longs to be with you just for being you, no frills attached. I have known you for so long, and yet only in this last year and a half had I the opportunity to love you. This has been and will be my greatest achievement. I promise to take care of your heart, cherishing it more than mine. I promise to love and love you forever. Today you have hung a cross around my neck and you have placed a ring around my finger. There's no one like you on earth. Never has been, never will be. You are a man beyond compare. In the Trinity, of you, me, and Christ, there is perfection. I am my lover's, and my lover is mine. By the grace of God Almighty, to introduce to you, now wedded together as one, Mr. and Mrs. Bivin George.
came to India for my own wedding. And you know, that's how much he, he values and cares about the relationships in his life. I'm really amazed by how God works because lo and behold, they have come together. After she worked with Bivan in Kenya, they fell in love. Bivan is an amazing gentleman and has a lot of patience. <laughs> I truly think from the core of my heart, there is no better match for Shelly. So today is a great day for my family as my son is getting married and I wish him all the best in his life. I know that he got the best partner. Shelly, welcome to our family. When I asked Vivin how he knew you were the one, he said that you were so affectionate and everything is just so simple and makes sense with you. Thank you for making him feel so loved from the beginning. The way you guys love each other, love your family, your friends, and the community is not only amazing, but inspiring. Cheers to an amazing journey together, always remembering the love you feel for each other during the best of times and the worst of times. <laughs>